Chewy, want to go to the motorcycle show? Too bad. Bye. Hello everyone, this is Berlin Biker. And today we are going to the Berlin Motorcycle Days Motorcycle Show. Um, super excited. I was actually going to ride my motorcycle today to the show because you know you ride motorcycles to motorcycle shows to be a badass and do all that kind of stuff. But unfortunately, it snowed a bit last night. Just a little bit, but the roads are a little icy. So I said, whatever, I'll just drive a drive now mini cooper there and stay a little warmer and then i'll have to deal with the helmet and the jacket and all that stuff so let's go and we are off So it took 10 minutes to drive there and took 15 minutes to find a parking space. The new venue doesn't have a parking structure, so that's dope. But, but there's always a, high, a good side to everything, right? Bright side. Uh, I found a really dope green Land Rover Defender with like some kind of metal uh, pop-up camping top on the back. So I'm gonna go look at that now. And there it is. There. So cool. All right. Uh, yes, please. All the lights, that tires. Hopefully there is no one inside. So. Got that snorkel. So. I'm just kind of excited about this because, well, first off, I'm excited about that. So much freedom. But before the show, I wanted to get some stickers made. So I have a bunch of Berlin biker stickers. So if you find me on the show, I'm gonna give you some. And I also have a t-shirt if you want that too, but you gotta ask. As I'm walking around the building, trying to find the entrance, they probably should do a better job at marking that. Uh, some bikes that I'm super excited to see. One, the Ducati Scrambler 1100. I think this bike is beautiful and it takes the normal Scrambler into a much better more adult feel um after that i want to see the new yamaha r6 who knows maybe a switch is in order um what else is out of course the ktm duke 790 i am very interested in that and i'm also interested in just sitting on the what is it the 1090 the adventure bike for some reason i keep thinking more and more about an adventure bike like an adventure bike and a cafe bike mix. You have one bike for the off-roads and the long trips, and you have one bike that's perfect for the street. Um, but yeah, I think that's the ultimate two, car, two motorcycle garage in my mind. So I'm gonna go take a look at this, and hopefully I can find the entrance into the show. So hang on.
because it wouldn't be a motorcycle show in Germany without a beer garden. Okay, so I am halfway through the show. I needed to take a break. Um, so far, the best bikes have been the Kawasaki, the 900 RS Cafe Edition. I'm not sure if I'm right, but I'll probably add some title to this screen if I mispronounced it. Um, the new Duke 790, the KTM, is beautiful. Um, super sharp. I completely understand why they nicknamed it the Scalpel. I get it. Um, the Triumph Thruxton R, of course, is a beautiful, beautiful bike. What else? I don't know, this show is interesting. It's much smaller than it was last year. It's very compact. The, the OEM manufacturers don't have a lot of space to present their bikes. So overall, it just seems like a much smaller show. Um, with the smaller space comes a lot of people bumping into you and not really caring that you are you know, taking photos and whatnot, which is fine, they don't need to. Um, it does smell insane in here, like not good in any way. It smells a lot like beer and weird beverages and they're smoking hot dogs and stuff. Kind of interesting. But I'm gonna go see Aprila next and Yamaha and go see what else I can find. Cool guys. Yamaha RZF 250, where's the gas tank? That's some trick shit. I can't put it back with one hand. 